What's going on YouTube? Holy cow, man. Do I have some incredible news? So UFC Undisputed 3 is getting modded to modern day UFC and Rising Fighting Federation into a game called UFC Undisputed Forever. And as you see the trailer on your screen right now, this is going to turn into something spectacular. Developed by this incredible team, Randy Parker, King Hydo 5, SBLOMX, and the UFC veteran. They are building on what is an incredible MMA game into something absolutely special with upwards of 60 fighters at present and more planned including Ryzen Fighting Federation you see the Venom shorts updated attire updated gloves canvases and new belts this is UFC undisputed forever look at this Habib and Tony the fight that didn't they try to fight like four times and it never happened oh my gosh this is one fight that I wish happened and it just never did man look at this but now it could happen in this game both of them, like that's incredible Habib was not in this game we got some rise in action soccer kicks to the face this is some wild stuff as you are seeing look at Pereira in there and they've updated 60 fighters and counting and it's ongoing look at that Morphing of Anderson into Adesanya. You got Amanda Nunes, Shevchenko. Yeah, I think Rose Namajunas was on the canvas there. <laughs> it was a TJ Dillashaw sighting. But to have these people go back and just mod an incredible game. Look at Cyril Gaon. Is something that people really need to be thankful for. I wish that they have a donate link because I'm going to donate to these guys to really support what is something absolutely special. How about this Edwards the left kick that was heard around the world what a transition from the animation to the still but this is incredible stuff. I want to show you guys the discord to show you just how ongoing this community is when it comes to improving and building okay here we go all right, now here's the Discord. Now the Discord's very important because it's going to keep you up to date on the add-ons that they are going to be inputting into this beautiful modded <laughs> Undisputed 3, known as Undisputed Forever. So I wanted to show you guys this. Here's some updated models. Look at Johnny Skywalker, look at that face. That's incredible, man. Like the skills that people have to go into a game and mod it is something just beyond my talents that's for sure look at Bo Nickel that's a very accurate Bo Nickel let me just scroll down Cody Garbrandt <laughs> let's see let's see what else they have here I'm not gonna show everybody Patty the Batty Pimplet is facing El Kukui Tony Ferguson Tony's gotta retire man somebody's gotta tell him he's gotta retire but Patty the Batty's in the game so what they're doing is guys that are no longer active under the UFC banner, they're replacing them with guys that are on the roster, that are active on the roster. So how about this? Max Holloway, Bless Holloway version 2. With his hair grown out, little goatee action. Wow, Arnold Allen? Man, that is very accurate. You got Nick Diaz with the beard. This is Nick Diaz north of 35 years old. Still competing. And how about this? Why would they write that? Fat Jones? Come on, Randy Parker. <laughs> it's Heavyweight Jones. It's got the Chuck Liddell belly going on right there. Heavyweight Jones. How cool is this that they had to use a program to just change his body type, make him a little thicker. 95, the heavyweight champ. Soon to defend his title against Stipe. And now right here you have Sugar Sean O'Malley and Aljamain Sterling. The, the O'Malley model is very accurate. They got to work on the Sterling one a little bit. But uh, you got to give much respect to these guys, man. This is incredible. I love, look at this. Look at this, Marvin Vittori. <laughs> Mr. Italia himself. 
I can't believe that they're able to do this. And then look. Wow, Rafael Dos Anjos. With the stash. Showcasing the stash. Like, the attention to detail is incredible. And then they have two versions of Conor McGregor. You know, shaved head Conor. And the hair slightly grown out, both with the beard. And if you see them in action, sporting the Irish green. And holy smokes, Conor McGregor is definitely not in this game. And his body type is so on point. Some muscle, lean. Like, that's great stuff. I can't believe McGregor's 35. So there he is. How fun is this going to be? I, I can't wait to play this. I cannot wait to play this. Leon Edwards. Max Holloway. Look at the Max model. That's great. Uh, oh, Holland. <laughs> it's on point, man. And then here's Habib. Oh, so the Habib's in there. I'm going to... um. Let me mute the music here. But Habib. Wow, is he cycling through? Dan Hooker. Patty Pimblett. Are we going to get a little action here? Are we going to get... A, I didn't think that there was any footage of the modded game. Can you tell I'm excited? I am beyond excited right here. Let's see. Oh, it's just still loading. Let me see if I can... Oh, yeah, here we go. This is in the training facility. Oh, and nobody's controlling Patty the Batty. That is amazing. Oh, I'm telling you, the fluidity of this game is something that needs to be respected. It still looks great. Tied to Avasa? <laughs> Look at the big man. He's got the tattoos. I love that tattoo. It's like a shield. But um, this is something that it, it's not fully released as yet. But um, it's up there. New versions of Fighters. Dustin version 4 replacing Anthony Pettis. And all the tattoos are on point. It's got the hair too. Grown out hair. Man. That's in Barbosa. I thought Barbosa was in the game. Maybe he's not. But this is, I can look through this forever. I thought this was uh, Chris Lieb in here. Who is this? JDM. Wow, he even got the nose on him. This guy's got the, the coolest nose. He just fought. Wow. Jack Della Maddalena. That is impressive that they're able to make his nose like that. Like how it is in real life. Kind of indented there. Oh my gosh, Anthony Smith. Come on, that's pretty accurate. Especially over here, these guys are. Over here, he's looking a little tired. Like he, uh, <laughs> been out a little too late. But, uh, man, I can go through all the uh, different, see the different game, they show gameplay as well. Let's see a little gameplay. Hold on, let's see a little gameplay. Uh, I don't even know which one to pick. Um, oh, Jemayev, he's in the game? I used to love how they blurred. Let me see, hold on. Ah, oh, there's no sound. Oh, da oh, wait, there is sound. Hold on, let me rewind that. Gets rocked, what is he gonna do? What is he gonna do? Oh, big head kick. And another. Is he gonna go for the sub? He's hesitant. He's hesitant. Oh, nice. Oh, a five, six piece combo. Followed by an uppercut and a right hand. It's over. I kill everybody. <laughs> He's standing back like there's nothing. Oh my gosh, man. I'm so excited for this. When is this coming out? Anybody know the inside scoop? And let me know if you wanna see more. Man, I could show you more footage for days, especially on this Discord. So let me know, I'll end off this video. I didn't want to make this video too long. This is Ricky J, Undisputed Forever's coming. And I am so, so excited. Uh oh, here we go. Conor McGregor. How about, like, see, see how they, they have like punching up against the cage.
They got to do that. They got to do that in future games, man. Kenny Florent. They got the names wrong at the bottom there. It should be Chandler and McGregor. But it's still in production. But see, that little thing right there of just those little punches to annoy your opponent, to get them to move so you can transition into a submission is something that needs to be brought back to MMA games. And I just love how this game sl is slower paced compared to other games. Look at that. Oh, it's actually McGregor that went into the... That's so amazing. It's like McGregor went into that submission just to get out of that bad spot. Now he's throwing... Wow, he's throwing 12 to 6 elbows on his back. Oh... Come on, McGregor, survive, brother. Grab an arm, grab an arm. Oh, it's over. But anyways, guys, I'll end off this video. Let me know your thoughts on this, and I will see you next time. It's Ricky J. Much love, brother and sisters out there. Take care.